Well, hey guys, what's up? Spartan85 here. We're picking up right where we left off in the last episode. This is the Wanderer series. Horror every night and no storage, if you don't know what it is. Uh, I'm going to pick up these torches before we go, just so I don't have to make more, and I'm not really having much luck hunting right now. So we'll pick up, we'll pick up these right now, and I think we'll go out this way right here. So real quick, I'll go ahead and mark this on the map. That way I don't use it again. Um, we'll say night two. Boom, there we go. Okay, so let's go knock out this uh, rally point real quick. We got a zombie right there, but we got no time for that. So I have, a really quick, if you if you don't remember from the last episode, I have a few things I can sell to the trader. Uh, I'm going to go and scrap that cooking pot. Probably not the greatest idea, but I'm going to go and scrap it just so I have the extra storage. We can find another one pretty easy, and I don't really have anything to cook down. Uh, so let's go ahead and do this rally point. We'll clear the job. We'll be able to turn that into the trader, collect our reward, and hopefully find something close to do again. And then we'll have to find another horde base. So I was told by somebody to sell these feathers. How much are they worth? Fifteen? Eh, they're only worth two. I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna keep those, and what I've been doing is eating these eggs. They don't give you any chance of dysentery. They help your health, and they give you a little bit of food. So I've been eating these eggs as I pick them up. Let's have a little fun. Ah, nice. Yeah, I need to get some transportation real bad. This whole Walking 700, 700 kilometers kind of sucks. Look at that POI over there. That's pretty cool. Is it designed that way or is that a glitch? We'll grab some of this yucca while we're out here. No, wait, is that designed that way? I, don't, I, I haven't seen that at all. Even in some of the YouTube playthroughs and some of the other playthroughs, I have not seen anything like that. That is crazy. Huh. Unless I just have totally missed that in, in Alpha 18, but I think that's new in Alpha 19. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. Let me know if that's new or what. Okay, here it is here. Uh, I am going to try a new editing style on this too. I'm going to let you guys right know right now. Uh, I'm trying to keep these episodes around 20 minutes, 20 to 23 minutes long. So I'm not going to show every single piece of loot because I'm not taking every single piece of loot for once. And I'm not going to show every single single zombie kill. Now if I get, a, if I get involved with a whole bunch of zombies, then I'll show that. But I'm trying to keep these down because the Horde Knights are going to start getting a little crazier and longer. So, uh, just let me let me know up front if there is something cool I find in like a cabinet, like a like a book or something like that. Then I'll be sure and include it. We'll take that glue. I'm gonna go and turn that into duct tape right now. There we go. Ah, uh, there's a dog. That sounds like a wolf. All right, let's get in here. We'll waste enough time. I don't know what that dog is doing. I got a bunch of zombies trying to come in. Oh yeah, here we go. Whoa! Come on, guys. That wasn't so bad. I'm liking this sledge. Man, I must have a wandering horde outside, I guess. Man, do we have any more? Oh my gosh. 
That wolf is still outside, too. Oh, there's the wolf. Oh, man. Let's go and harvest him. Where are you going, dude? Oh, now I'm stuck. Oh, I got stuck on something right there. What is he doing? That is so weird. I am extremely encumbered. I got more zombies outside. That's freaking Mo. Man, I don't know what the deal was, but I had basically a wandering horde showed up. I'm going to repair all this stuff while I can. And I am so turned around in this POI now. I was trying to manage my inventory a little bit. Uh, let's see what I can drop real quick. That brass is going to sell for a bunch. Uh, that's going to sell for five. Let's just scrap it. Uh, that's going to sell for 50. I tell you what, while I'm standing here, I'm, while I'm, I'm kind of raiding this place, I'm going to put a campfire down. I think all, all I can really make is charred meat, but it's better than nothing. We'll make our charred meat, and we'll go ahead and uh, boil this water also. It says I can make some glue. Let's just go ahead and make some glue. We'll go ahead and make a yucca juice too, since I have some of this. There we go. Man, this is becoming harder and harder to manage inventory. Oh, I just ate that meat. I didn't mean to do that. I'm going to drop the plastic parts. Uh, drop the plant fibers. All right, that's good for now. Let's clear out the rest of this house. We are wasting so much time. I don't know where you're supposed to go. Looks like down is the way. There's uh, Harry. He looks like Harry from Dumb and Dumber to me. That's why I call him Harry. I got more zombies coming. Oh, there we go. Let's uh, let's read that note. Kill some zombie football players. That'll be fun. Definitely need to get some better guns before that. Okay, where is the main loot? It's got to be in here, right? Yeah, it looks like it's in here. Is there anything back here? There's a purse. We'll just eat that food now. I'm just going to drink that water now, too. Actually, we'll just take it. There was another dog outside. Okay, here's the main loot. Looks like we don't have to deal with any zombies. There's a red tea. Uh, iron crossbow bolt I'm not worried about. I'm just going to leave it there. Actually, you can scrap those. I'm going to scrap those is what I'll do. Uh, let's see. Can I... Wear... I'll wear those and scrap those. These are a little better than the ones I have on, so we'll just take them. we got tons of stuff to sell. Yeah, so we'll wear the... We'll go and modify these. We'll throw on those modified uh, connectors on there. And then we will wear these. And then scrap these. I think that's pretty good. We shouldn't have any trouble getting back getting back with this. Oh, there's an engine we can sell. And we can sell those motor tool pots for 40. And we'll scrap that axe. Alright, we do have a dog out here. Or a wolf of some sort. Oh, that's a long drop. Um, let's see if I can make it. Without... Okay, good. I was going to say, I cannot take any damage. Where's that wolf? There he is. Oh, it's a coyote. Okay, let's... uh. Oh, one hit. And I leveled up. We'll take that. You know, I have this bone knife that I'm not even using. I'm just going to go and scrap it for the space. Alright, we're moving pretty slow because we're so encumbered. It's going to be a while before we get there. But we have a bunch of meat we can cook up, and I'm just going to go and eat this yucca to clear it out. 
I can make a padded chest armor. Let's go ahead and craft that. I was building some stamina. I was just kind of curious if I could craft any armor. Uh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? God dang it. I hate it when it crafts it and you don't know where it went. There it is. So let's go and wear that. Man, that was a long, long walk. Holy moly, I'm moving so slow with being encumbered. What's yeah. up? What's up? That's, that's interesting there. I think I'm going to do the shotgun shells because we're going to need ammo down the road. All right, please have a job close. He has a clear zombies 256 away. Uh, let's do that, and we'll probably just use that as our horde base. Well, all righty then. Let's get the ball rolling. All right, we're going to sell some stuff to you, Rick. Cool. Okay. Um, he restocks tomorrow. Let me just see if by chance he has a... I don't remember if he has a bicycle or not. No, not there. He has a 4x4 truck for 60 grand. So no bicycle. He might have one tomorrow. He didn't have, have a shotgun, does he? Uh, no shotgun either. Okay. That's fine. And I just realized I had this fat here. So let's turn this fat into a torch. Alright, that's good. Now we'll drop the rest of this brass too. Alright, cool. Let's go check out where this uh, job is. This will probably be where we hold down the uh, hold down the horde for the night, probably. I'm expecting, what, probably ten zombies at max. We had three last night. I'll check that bird's nest. Yeah, nothing I want. Hoping that tomorrow, he restocks tomorrow, we have enough to buy a bicycle. So I'm really hoping that he has a bicycle tomorrow. Well, there's another engine to sell. Oh man, I know what this place is. This is where I, this was my base for uh, Rando Man, uh, my horde every night in Alpha 18. Oh, this is cool. Okay. We got a hunting rifle schematic. Um, gosh, that sells for 160, but yeah, let's just sell it. Uh, we'll sell that one too. We'll sell them both. I know we're, the, we're already encumbered probably, but oh well. Well, there's another schematic. And yeah, we'll sell that too. There's, there's a whole bunch of coin right there. Um, let's see. We'll scrap those, and I'm not going to worry about that. I could sell it, but I'm already encumbered. Yeah, so I built a base out of this place, held it down for about 10 days, hoard every night. Pretty, It was pretty fun. Well, there's a wrench. Um, we'll take that. There's more red tea. Come on out. Surprised nobody's waking up. Well, surely, I mean, yeah, there's, they're probably up here, I guess. Come on, guys. Still not gonna, man, she must have partied hard last night. Biker. Crawler got through. Alright, he's a goner. Alright, here is the main loot. So these are a little better. We'll just uh we'll scrap those. What that's a impact bracing mod. We'll see if we can do it what we can do with that. Level 3 bow. We will replace that. We're doing good on ammo so far. All 
All right, let's see what we can do. Um, we'll say modify. Yeah, we have an extra spot, so we'll put those on our boots. We'll scrap these couple cans here. Uh, we got some chairs to scrap, looks like it. And we're doing good on food, looks like it. I'm going to get rid of these stone arrows. They're not really good for anything. And I think I'm going to get rid of this paper, too. Um, I can buy blunderbuss ammo. and we have, we have enough. I'll probably regret that later, but... Okay, so this place is cleared out. We can... We, let's, let's get our horde base ready. And then if we have time, we'll go to the trader. I'm going to go harvest some wood so I can make some spikes for the night. Real quick. Okay, I do have one skill point to use. Um, I kind of want to go Lucky Looter. Um, I'm going to go that route. I know it kind of got nerfed in Alpha 19, but I, I'm just so used to going that way. So, here's what I'm kind of thinking here. Let me... Did somebody just wake up in here? Man, I have a lot of zombies today. Good grief. This has been a zombie killing day, which I have no problem with at all, by the way. And I'm thinking about setting... Well, and they can jump over this, I know that. So I'm thinking about setting up the, the turret maybe in here somewhere. And bringing them up the stairs. And I'd like to make it harder for them to get to me. So I'm going to take out one set of stairs so they have to jump. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll take out the next one in a minute. Let's go and make some wood spikes. I'm going to make ten. And we'll do some barbed wire fence. We, we only need about... I don't know if I'm going to make four, probably. I'm hoping they'll come through this way. And I'll leave this front door unlocked. Uh, just wide open. I don't care. But I want them to come through here. And then come through here. And then I'll lay the spikes probably right here. Is what I'll do. Let's take care of this zombie so he didn't wreck my plans. Alright. Man, we have been overrun. So I'm going to leave this door open because I want them to come this way. And then... I'll go and shut that and I'll just upgrade it that much. And I'll lay the spikes here. I want them to come this way. And then where's my... Let's get my frames out here. I'm just going to put a frame there because I don't want them to go this way at all. I don't want to give them any ideas. And then let's put the spikes here. And I know I could have put a, probably some frames along this wall too to make them go one way, but that that's okay. It's I'm not too worried about it. I like I said, I only expect probably ten zombies. I'm gonna put the junk turret there. He's gonna do his or his junk the junk turret the uh, the turret there. Let's go and make some more wood frames. I'm going to make a couple more barbed wire fences, too. I'm going to make two more. Let's go and make some frames. And the reason I'm doing over here is I've already had the slant here, so I don't have to build too high. I just have to build one. Like that. And then I'll go ahead and put them on this side also. And this might be overkill, I know, with, you know, but it's okay. I could have made flagstone, too. That would have been smarter, but it's all right. All right. And I will go ahead and make some flagstone blocks. We'll just make as many as we can. And the reason for that is the last time I I did this playthrough, they came through here. Or they came through they wanted to come through here. So I'm gonna put a flagstone there. And then I'm gonna just kind of wall this whole room in. I'm gonna put them right there. Cause I I don't want the what they're gonna try to do is they're gonna try to avoid. And I'll even upgrade these right here. So what they're going to try to do is they're going to try to avoid coming through here by going, by beating through this. 
through that other wall over there and then come in this way. I don't want them to do that. So, because that's what they did on, if you ever watched my Rando Man series, that's what they did. So, we want to try to avoid that. And I also have these Molotovs, too, we can use. Alright, it is time. Let's see if they outsmart me, like they usually do. Sounds like a few. It makes me nervous they're beating on something. They should be through that door down below already. Alright, that sounds like spikes being hit. 30 minutes in, I think they're coming up the stairs now. There they are. Whoa, they're already making it through. That was quick. Alright, we're gonna have to go, uh, flag snow already, looks like it. And I can't put it down. There we go. Okay. Did they make it through? Where are they at now? Man, they came, they got through quick. It sounds like they're in there. Oh, one of them made it through. Another one. And I am not loaded. I'm gonna have to bail, guys. Oh boy, oh boy, this isn't good. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh man, I'm stuck. They got me. Oh man. What a poor base design, man. What a poor base design that was. Alright guys, I'm recording this commentary a couple days later after I had some time to think about that death. That was a that was a rough death, guys. That was uh it it was dumb because I shouldn't have taken that, that frame out of the top of the door. We'll go down and see it here in just a second. I think I'm going down there right now. But yeah, when I when I took that frame out and I tried to put it back, that's when they jumped through. There's my backpack there. But yeah, this frame right here, um I tried putting it in, but he blocked me. This was what surprised me here, was the turret. The turret stopped working pretty early, and I th I don't know if they destroyed it or something, because if you look at my episode before that, that turret had plenty of health. So keep in mind with this turret, don't rely on this turret. Don't put your life in this turret's hand like I did. Um, it's It will break. And uh, So anyway, they did avoid all my spikes, as you can see, too. They basically went around the front porch here. And they, yeah, they went up through the stairs right here. So that's how they avoided my spikes. So, you know, I, I had a high hopes for this base, but they got through that. And that's what happens with this game. This game surprises you. And Alpha 19 surprises you every, every turn, at least with me. So this is my, kind of my ending of the episode here. Probably not going to continue this series. I usually play Permadeath. And... Honestly, this series isn't doing as well as Rocky. Rocky is doing really well, and I'm actually having a lot of fun with that series. So I'd like to focus more on Rocky, is what I'd like to do. So I also just want to let you guys know that I am on Twitch now. I'm not streaming yet, but I am on Twitch. It's Spartan85Gamer with underscores in between each word, and the link is in the description. So uh, if you guys want to follow me on Twitch, I'm hoping in the next two to three weeks to start streaming probably once a week on Twitch and I'm going to continue the uploads on YouTube also so nothing's going to change with YouTube but once a week I'm probably going to stream to Twitch something like that so uh, just want to let you guys know that and thanks as always for watching guys I really do appreciate it every all the support means a lot so all right this is a uh, Spartan 85 signing off and we'll uh, see you guys later bye